Hey, and welcome back to another video. So I just want to put this video today to answer a question that has been posted recently on a lot of forums such as Reddit and I think Quora regarding a issue facing, uh, basically faced by uh, the HomePod, especially the HomePod Mini, where if you ask Siri, like, what's the weather outside? It kind of has forgotten your location and it says weather for where. Uh, this also applies for other location-based requests, such as where's the nearest McDonald's, uh, where's the near nearest CVS, what's the best barbecue place nearby. Basically, any location request, Siri will be confused as to your location and it'll ask you uh, whether for where, uh, what location, uh, which city, which state, whatever. It's basically confused as to where you are. And uh, I figured out a few fixes for this uh, so that you can go ahead and get your HomePod working so that you don't have to answer another question for you to just get your answer. And you can just get your answer straight up when you ask Siri the first time. Um, these and the, 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 solu the solutions I'm gonna show you, uh, there are two easy ones and one slightly, uh, com well, it's not complicated, but it's a bit lengthy one. Uh, but the first two should definitely work out. Um, I've separated them in the slider down below so you can jump to whichever you want. Before we jump right into this video, don't forget to smash that like button as always, as it helps this video get on YouTube's algorithm and more people can actually see this fix as well. Also, if you like this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below and ring that bell notification button to get notified whenever I upload a new video. I'm on Instagram, Discord, and Twitter, and you can follow me on those using the links down in the description below. And now let's jump into the first fix, which is the location thing. Now, the first thing you're gonna do is you're gonna go to your settings, so you're going to go to privacy, then hit location services, and you're gonna find the home app. So the home app's over here, hit home app, and then make sure while using app is ticked and precise location is also turned on. Precise location is important because it get, lets the HomePod know exactly where you are. Also make sure while using the app is ticked. Now you're gonna go back to your home app itself and then you're gonna go click the, the house over there and you're gonna uh, well, basically click the house over there and you're gonna select home settings. Now I'm gonna take it off for a while because my email is there and you're gonna basically scroll down and make sure location services is turned on. If this is turned off by accident, probably uh, you accidentally turned it off. If this is turned off, it's not gonna work at all. So make sure location services is turned on. So do the two of these if you already haven't, and then give it about a minute, it should start working. Now, if that doesn't work, also make sure your HomePod is on the same Wi-Fi network as your phone. If you, uh, if you basically press and hold that, uh, you get this screen. And uh, there'll be a warning here saying that your HomePod is not on the same network as your iPhone. Uh, so go ahead and click that and make sure the HomePod is on the same network as your iPhone. This happens if you have two Wi-Fi networks and your main network has a connection issue. So the HomePod searches for the next best network and it connects to the other open network. So that's an issue. Uh, go ahead and make sure they're on the same Wi-Fi network. Now, if that doesn't work, there's a third fix, which is a bit uh, lengthy, but, well, it's not too lengthy, but uh, you can go ahead and try it, but it's highly unlikely you'll have to do this. And if you're wondering what John117 means, that's a Halo reference. I've just named my HomePod John117. Just forget about that, that's irrelevant. Anyway, so the third fix is you hit the home button over here on your home app uh, like that, and uh, then go into home settings. So uh, let's take it off screen for a while. Okay, home settings and then scroll down to location services. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna turn off location services. So completely turn off location services and then go back to settings and completely turn off location services for the whole phone as well. Turn it off for the whole phone. So location services turned off on the home app and on the whole phone. Then go ahead and soft reset your phone. So if you have a phone uh, without the uh, home button, basically a newer iPhone with the swipe gesture, um, it is volume up, quickly press volume up, then quickly press volume down and press and hold the home button for about 10 seconds until you see the Apple logo and that should reset your phone. It's a soft reset, don't worry. None of your data is gonna be erased. It's just a soft reset. So uh, volume up, volume down, power button, press and hold for 10 seconds. Uh, volume up and volume down, you don't have to press it and hold, just quickly press one, one, two, and press and hold the power button for 10 seconds until you see the Apple logo. For older iPhones like the iPhone 7, iPhone 8, and iPhone uh, SE second generation that have this touch home button, not an actual home button, but a touch home button, 
the reset combo is volume down and power button together. Press and hold both of them for 10 seconds until you see the Apple logo and then your phone resets. For older iPhones, even older ones, like the iPhone 6S, the iPhone uh, the um, iPhone 6, and uh, basically the ones with an actual physical home button, it's the home button plus the power button together for 10 seconds. So press the two of them and hold for 10 seconds. And once your phone uh, basically gets back to the menu and stuff, go back into location services, turn on location services on your phone for the whole phone, and then go back into home app and turn on location services there as well. Also make sure that your Wi-Fi is on the same network again by pressing and holding over here uh, make sure it's on the same Wi-Fi network here and then give it about a minute and it should start working so those are the few fixes that I found out that work for this issue where Siri forgets your location um, I hope this helped you and let me know down in the comments if it did if it actually did also don't forget to leave a big thumbs up on this video as it helps this video get on YouTube's algorithm and other people can find it as well so that it can help them also, don't forget to hit that subscribe button down below, ring that bell notification button as well, and check out my social media down in the description below. Thumbs up, and I'll see you guys in my next video.